for an up, another episode of What's in the Kitchen here at Carol Lutheran Village with me, Chef Kevin. Today I'm going to be doing a oyster shrimp pork boy wrap. But one of the things I think is important to talk about a little bit is keeping your knives sharp because that's a very important thing. Now you'll often see people taking and using a steel to hone their knives. The important thing to know is Using a steel is not going to sharpen the knife, it's to keep the edge on it. Now, you'll see a lot of the old videos where the chef will do this. I found a better way and a safer way is actually to rest it on the edge of the table. And you want it about 15 to 20 degree angle. And I'll do three slides this way, three slides this way to take that edge of burr off. And what you'll want to do is you'll slide across, feeling for a burr. And when you see people going this way, you want it to feel rough, it's not as smooth. If it feels smooth, your knife is not sharp. So now, moving on to the remoulade sauce that we'll be going with the shrimp. I'm gonna take a red onion. I always take the top side off, leaving the root end attached. I'll cut it down, and then I'm gonna peel it back. And then I make, because I want this very finely, almost minced, the smaller my cuts are here, the finer my mince will be. And I'm just going straight down, and that's why I left the root end attached, because now it will stay together. And then you've got to be careful here. I rest my hand flat, and I'm going to make a couple of cross cuts like this and then I'm just going to go very close together coming down for a very fine mince with my onion and then when I get to about there I'll do a couple of cuts this way bring it back up now I've got a flat spot so it's not going to roll and slide on me I'm going to just set that aside now for the remoulade I have before me about a quarter to a half a cup of mayonnaise. One tablespoon of Dijon mustard. A tablespoon of ketchup. Two teaspoons Worcestershire sauce. about a tablespoon of horseradish, uh, about a tablespoon of capers, a little bit of parsley, again that's probably about uh, two teaspoons, and then I would also put in a little bit of Tabasco sauce, and I'll do a couple of dashes because I like the heat. Now I'm just going to mix this all up. And I want to add in... I'm going to go... I like onions, so I'm going to do about three tablespoons of the minced red onion. And really, all remoulade is, is think of it as a spicier or more of a Louisiana-style tartar sauce. Now that I have made my remoulade sauce, I have three oysters that we've deep fried and about four ounces of buttermilk shrimp that we've deep fried. Now for the wrap, what I'm going to do, I'm going to take some remoulade and I'm putting that right down on the bottom. I'm going to lay my three oysters in, put down my four ounces of fried shrimp little bit of shredded lettuce and then the way I do a wrap I bring my edges in bring the top over trying to hold it with my fingers a little and then just do a little bit of a roll down and I squeeze it and then I just cut it a little bit on an angle and there you have a shrimp and oyster cold boy wrap Thank you. Please join us in the bistro and the cafe on Monday, Wednesdays, and Saturdays and enjoy the sandwich. Thank you.